how to enable autofill sms verification code so that the otp code will be automatically filled in through messages hi everybody welcome back to our channel i am pimo from app guide and in today's guide video i will show you the way on how you can enable the autofill sms verification code feature on your android but before we get started as always if you are new to our channel then make sure to leave a like and hit that subscribe button and without any further ado let's get started with today's video so if you want to enable the autofill feature first of all we will simply go Go ahead and then open up the settings app and once you open settings go ahead and then select the option which is general management so tap on general management and you'll see all of these options right over here at the bottom you'll find another section which says passwords and autofill so simply tap on passwords and autofill you can see google and you can also see autofill with samsung pass so tap on the gear icon and you'll be able to see all of your autofill codes and so on and you can also see all the list of all of these apps if you want to autofill with google for example then you could basically come back and scroll down and find the option which is google and google services i will tap on google services and you'll find another option which is autofill tap on it again as you tap on it you can see autofill with google tap on it over here and make sure that this is actually turned on and once this is turned on another thing you can also do is simply tap on phone number sharing make sure this is turned in as well and the main part of this video is this sms verification code so whenever you're trying to use some verification codes to automatically verify it you can tap on sms verification codes and make sure that the autofill service is turned on and also that the default browser is turned on and now whenever you receive a code and you're trying to verify some kind of otp codes on your applications the autofill feature is automatically going to fill in that otp code we hope the video was really helpful and if it did help you then make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel and if you have any more questions queries or doubts simply also make sure to leave them down thank you very much for watching till the end of this tutorial and see you soon in our next video